Welcome to today's quick tips for ABAP developers. Well, as developers, we deal with data extraction from a lot of Z tables. What we do is we end up opening SC16N and we we wonder what the table name was. And we search, 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 and we waste a lot of time doing that. At least I do. If only there was a way to somehow store them in a menu format with description and we find them and double click and it opens magically in a C16N. Well, here's a way. This is, here is what I do actually. Uh, step number one, we create a transaction, parameter transaction. So say our table is called ZAV sales order and we're going to create a transaction. It will be a transaction with parameters We'll say the transaction is going to be SC16N. And we specify the name of the table. As simple as that. Remove the error. Save it. As a local object because you don't want to transport it ever go to your tables folder you created you can create subfolders inside it if you so desire you will insert the transaction I just created And voila, it opens up your SC16N with the table name with the convenience of having organizing the tables as menu items on your start screen. That was a really quick tip. Thank you.